So welcome to another exciting video where we're going to be soldering on the, um, the dome tactile buttons. I really shouldn't make it, have to make a video for this, but some people feel they need to see how it's done. It's really easy. Uh, you just choose one of the four pads on each uh, button. Let's put something there. Makes it easier for us. You'll notice this one is missing a leg. It's only got one, two, three. The fourth one should have been here. Because of the cutout, uh, it's, it's not going to have. So we're going to skip that one, which is not a big deal. So <clears throat> they all go up this way, except for the, the D pad. They go the long way. The contacts are on each corner here 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 and here so that's how you would line them up you just kind of place it there heat it up that's it it's solid it ain't moving you kind of want to give it a little bit of space, so probably move it up because this one's kind of right on top of the other pad. Okay, that looks okay. Now we can add solder to the other pads. Okay. Next one. You can use tweezers or your fingers, doesn't matter. Whatever is easier for you to manipulate where you're putting these pads. In this case, Using my fingers, this is the easier method. Or not. A little bit more solder, clean the tip. Got plenty on there this time. Should be good. There we have it. It's kind of position that little bit so it covers the uh, the space well for the pads. Now don't be worried about like some of them are going to kind of almost overlap like these. These are the grounds, so they're all connected. So it's not a big deal if one's touching or close to it. These are all all the ones um, where that's important are separated enough where you'll be fine. Those are done. So these go the opposite way, <clears throat> the long way. Raise that off. Rotating them this way. I'm right-handed, so it's easier for me to start on this corner. It's a ground point, so it takes a little bit more heat. But 
That's on there. Just applying the solder to the pads. And once you heat it up enough, it'll just melt onto the, uh, the little exposed pad under the, bo uh, under the button. And then it's solid. It ain't going nowhere. And that's pretty good. Now, if you're going to do the only A and B button setup, the two button setup, like it comes default in a shell. You just do these top buttons here. Even though they are labeled Y and X, uh, they can be remapped to just A and B or B and A. And these two can be skipped. But for this video, I'm going to solder on everything. have it. The buttons are on there and you know you need the, the membranes if you need to test things out. Once you got the pie soldered in with the uh, SD card and all that you can just test them out right by hand. So I hope that helped some people that were wondering about how to solder. The most important thing is these go up and these go this way. You can tell there's a difference. So you got to make sure that these are soldered on the way I have them here. Unlike the rest of these which go the long way. Alright, thanks for watching.